Hello everybody, welcome back to a brand new review. My name is Bokusatsu. Well, it's also anime. Yeah. My name is Bokusatsu. I'm here to review a figure that I, well, I've been wanting to get for a while. Also, I want to say that I just woke up, so please forgive me if I feel a little tired. But today we're here to review the, the not SA figure, no, 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 no. No, the, the Mayfex Huntress. The Mayfax Huntress from Hush. And I gotta be dead. I gotta be honest. I did not know anything about this character. I'm sorry. Why did I bought the figure? One. One, I'm trying to get my hands on, on, on all the Hush figures. And two, the only time, the only thing I remember, the only thing I know about Huntress is from the DC animated properly. Like, See, so pay like what? You pay like what? Two episodes, I think, and just the anime, just the unlimited. In one episode, well, I know two episodes of Batman: The Brave and the Bold, and that's it. But besides that, that's, that besides that, that's basically all I know about Hunter. And yes, I know about her Earth Two counterpart, but this is, but this isn't her Earth Two counterpart. So anyway, so anyway, yeah, Huntress. How is this figure, Aaron? She's good, but I figure out, but damn, uh, we got a lot to talk about this figure. Okay, first off, how, okay, first off, how good, how good is she for, like, for her arms? So this is how far her, this is how far her arm, her arms go up. Even though if you move your cape, that's how, that's how far her arms go. Going further, well, you'll break the figure, you don't want it. This, this is how far she goes for here, for here, for here, to here. Her legs are actually, her legs are really flexible and really good. So. If you feel like it, you can put her like in a fighting pose. If you feel like, if you, if you feel like it, see. I will say, I will say that, uh, she doesn't do, she doesn't come with a lot. She posed pretty well, yeah, but, uh, I want to talk about my issue with the figure when, when, when we go to her, uh, well, accessories. So let me go get those right now. Alright, so I have her accessories with me. So, first off, one of my issue with this figure that, uh, in order for me to put in her serious face right here, in order for me to put in her serious face, I had to play, you have to play around, well, my copy, well, my copy knows it, but, uh, I had to play around by taking off, by, uh, by, 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 uh, I had to play around a little bit with the head and uh, play with the neck joint like this and doing this because this thing, this, this thing right here is really stuck. Let me buy part of my copy, but uh, this thing, this neck piece does not want to come off when I first, when I first uh, got this figure. And then it was annoying as heck. And it's weird though. I don't. I probably have. I probably have like a weird copy though. But yeah. Here's her serious face. Don't. 
don't don't like other don't like other head sculpts that comes in this figure. Here's her bow staff. You know Mayfax. You could turn it you, you could turn it into a Robin bow staff. Just saying. Just make it just make the Robin Hush figure. I know you guys are working on it. And it probably won't come out until next year. But uh, hey, I, I'm just saying I need my Tim Drake, so get to it, boys. Ha <laughs> ha ha ha. Next thing you know, uh I say that and uh there, next thing you know, I say that and uh Mayfax announced that. <laughs> here are her here are her relaxing here are her pointy hands. Well, yeah, her relaxing hands too. Here are her well these are like, well, well, these are more, well, these are more like her, uh, how can I say this? Her palm hands? But, at the same time, you can also, you can also use these hands for her to fight someone. Here are, here are her hands, make her whole weapons, because, well, let me show you something. So, my copy of this figure has a hard time has a really hard time with holding a weapon. See? This figure is good, but uh, my, but but uh, I feel like she's he's kind of a little bit uh underwhelming and a little bit lackluster. But uh, hey, she's still a good figure overall. So my so so my issue is that uh, her pegs for her wrist does not want to hold her weapon every time every time I try to pose her because this this pan always pops off. Now, I don't know why. I just, I said, I said, I gotta be very gentle, careful with how I do that for the, for the figure. But, uh, but yeah, it's a, it's a, it's an issue. It always happens when I try to pose it up. This. <laughs> Madcon, all, all I'm saying is this fixer if you're gonna make like another female figure that part of the bat family you guys need to update a lot of stuff you guys do with huntress and make it better because this body mold i can see perfectly be used for well okay i, I know i know this body mold this, this, female, this female body mold it's cat woman's i get that but this body mold right here they can totally use this to make like a female Batgirl. They can use this scope to make like a Batgirl, a Batwoman. Hell, origin. Just saying. Give me Barbara Gordon, Cassandra Kane, and Stephanie Brown. <laughs> give me, give me them you cowards. I could, yeah, I can totally see them using this to make an orphan. A yeah, orphan body, well, well, a Stephanie, a Stephanie Brown Mayfax figure. Dean Blue Crew, I didn't even know anything about Batman. Bro, let me tell you something. I know my, I know something more about Batman than Superman. I'm a Batman fan. <laughs> and we also have his. We also have her attack. We also have her, uh, her, uh, I don't know what to call these, but uh, another set of hands. I forgot. I don't know what to call these. Please forgive me. And those are all her. And those are all of the accessories she come with. Yes, she doesn't come with a lot. <laughs> Unlike Nightwing or Batman, they come with a lot, but she doesn't. But to be fair, Huntress didn't appear that much in, in the comic, so it's also that too.
Now on to size comparison. So here we have her with the SH figure art. Uh, Go Superhero Gohan. No, I did not buy Beast Gohan. I do not care for that form. Here she is with the SH figure art. Red Falcon. Alright. Here she is with the Mayfax Blue Cape Batman. I'll look at that. <laughs> Here she is with the Mayfax Medicon Black Cape Batman. She seems to pick up with both of them, though. I'm not going to lie. While I do prefer the black cape version with more because, his, his, because Mayfax fixed all the Kyushu issue from this from this release and make it ten times better with, with this one. And I love him. I love him because of that. Okay, this guy's my definitive Batman. This guy's my definitive Batman in my collection. And here's the secret. Here's the secret. Another Mayfax figure that I just reviewed last week. Well, well, a couple of days ago, I meant to say, not last week. The Medicon Mayfax Nightwing, aka one of my top ten figures of the year. Give me Tim, you cowards! I want Tim Drake. I'm just saying, she stands pretty well with with Nightwing. And here she is with the Lightning Collection, a uh, Foot Soldier. From from the team at T two pack. Not gonna lie, she stand she stand pretty well with him. All right. Here she is with the S H figure coming alive. I will I will. He he probably be the next figure I will review, but uh here here she is with Buffer. Alright. So what did I think overall? I'll come back I'll come back with you with a conclusion. B or B. Alright, so what so so what my nah, so guy. So what are my thoughts on her? If you're looking for a good female, uh, if you're looking for a good female figure that that part of the Bat family that's also made by Mayfex. I'll say pick it up just to complete your Mayfax Hux collection. But I'll say this: if you, I'm supposed to say this. Uh, well, in the future, Mayfax is definitely gonna be making a Batgirl. I can feel it; they will. And uh, this this body mold is perfect for it. The figure's good, but at the same time, there are things that there are things in the thing that really that got my nerves, like. Like her neck peg, her neck peg pretty hard to get for me to strip to strop out her heads. <laughs> funny, funny, funny though. You, you, you can see it here right there. But yeah, her neck peg playing hard to get for me, stropping out her heads all the time. Her joints, her her ball joints for me, stropping out her hands. It are really loose. I mean, they're supposed to be loose, yeah, but at the same time. Hers are really loose, and uh, I had to be very gentle with how I pose her with the bow staff. The, f the effects. No, the accessories she's coming are pretty lackluster, in my opinion. They could have been better. Because I know that DC had no gun rule in the figures right now, and a sadly, that affected Mayfax as well. But uh, in the comics, she comes with a crossbow and a bow staff. It sucks that uh, it sucks that uh, she doesn't have a crossbow. But yet, but yet, Hush was the last Mayfax figure to have guns. Just saying. DC, you you know gun rule, you know gun rule, has affected important that 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 actually got on my nerves. I'm not gonna lie. 
But anyway, overall, this figure's all right. She's good, but not, but nothing special in my opinion. Suppose, well, if you want to take, if, you could take good pictures with her Batman, Nightwing, and many other many other the Hush figures. So overall, I'll say this: if you're a big fan, of Batman. Uh, sorry about that. If you're a big fan of Batman, like I am, and uh, if damn it, sorry about this thing's acting weird. If you're a big fan of Batman, like I am, and uh, if you're a big fan of DC Comics and DC in general. Make me pick her up, but if but if you're not but if you're not a fan of Batman or you don't like Mayfax in general, then don't get her. But yeah, that's 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 all I'm gonna say. My name's Aaron. Please like, comment, subscribe. Follow all my social media in the description. Follow my Twitch account. I stream about Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday on Twitch. I'll, I'll put the link in the description as well. And uh, yeah, guys, my name's Aaron, and I'm out. Enjoy the pictures. Have a nice day. Bye.